We are almost out of the woods for winter. However, a cold front is coming my way this week and we need some type of comfort food, type of hearty soup, something, okay? So I have some things in my cabinet. Thinking of two meals, one's already, I know what I have, have it all. And the other, maybe a little, throw this, a little that, so forth. We'll see. But let me get to the organization part of my meal prepping on this episode of Savory Cakey and Self Care. Come along. When it comes to the first meal that I am prepping, it's going to be a tomato bisque. So you will need a hand blender, or if you have one of those fancy dancy ones that go vroom. Okay, those will work. But this is what I typically use to blend my tomato sauce and everything else. Given that I have Put that to the side. And this is the brand if anybody inquires. Okay. Now, usually what I use is whole peeled tomatoes, but given that I have this in my pantry, we're going to be using all purpose tomato sauce. This is a 28 ounce can usually a recipe calls for two 14 ounce cans but this will suffice for a couple of bowls use your favorite or on hand salt heavy whipping cream and of course pepper onion powder garlic powder tomato basil seasoning. I think this adds a very nice addition to the restaurant type of bisque that you would get. And last but not least, some red onion. It is in the bag right now, so I promise you it's red onion. You can see it from that angle. There we go. Welcome back to the corner as I have no clue what I am about to put together but I know I want to include gravy and chicken breasts. I think it may be a pasta like dish so we definitely are going to need a chicken breast. Still frozen so it's going to be thawed out. Pasta like this cheese ravioli rice thing like this creamy chicken man, or maybe real pasta like or maybe this pesto style gnocchi so these are my options chicken breast with gnocchi chicken breast with the instant noodle creamy chicken or the frozen four cheese ravioli Hmm, comment below which one would be your favorite. I decided to go with the Naki. As I have several gravies, I decided on doing the classic chicken gravy. Homemade garlic bread by using a loaf of bread with some monster. <laughs> 
cheese. We're gonna see if this comes together. Okay, no, can't use this um, because why is the expiration date? Focus this. Literally, I just got handed this today. What is going on? So, nope. You are in my cabinet right now. So, let's see. Let's move the melatonin. See what type of grain we got that we can use. Now I'm thinking maybe a garlicky butter noodle. Some mini elbows. That's what I'm kind of leaning towards. I want a smaller noodle. Want something that doesn't overtake the chicken. It's looking like that's gonna be my alternative. And I may do a side. Like I said, this is a reach in my cabinet and have a collaborative effort with what I have. And of course, the garlic bread is my thing because one thing about me and two things for sure, I love me any type of potato, noodle, and chick. And I will be set. I will see y'all when I start making these meals. Good night.